Alright guys, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So let's go ahead and get started. As y'all know, we are making money replaces today based on the title. So let's get into it. This was real cheap at Walmart and it's just um, dividers. I'm just going to use these as a guide so I know exactly where to cut. I'm just going to follow it along here, boom, boom, and I'm just going to cut them. Um, and then I'll be right back. We have four here. So we'll go ahead and start designing. We'll do four today, four designs. I already have two, so I really didn't need that many. First things first. And I got a lot of these at Walmart in the arts and crafts part, like a dollar or two. Um, and then I went to Dollar Tree, I got them for a dollar twenty-five. Can you believe Dollar Tree went up to a dollar twenty-five? Man, everything is going up. If you hear any kids in the background, the kids are out of school, so they're doing their thing in the other room. So you might hear them. Y'all, this doesn't have to be like perfect. You know, you just do what you can. Do as good as you can. That's all, you know? Have fun with it. This is your time to create. And then we'll top it off with, and this was from Hobby Lobby. And um, Hobby Lobby was about $1.50 as well. They had everything that was, um, the paper studio was half off. So it says $2.99, but it was $1.50 because it was half off. There we go. Kind of satisfying. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, a little bit satisfying there. No, we're going this way, this direction, moving forward, not backwards, right? Now it's a matter of lining it up. Boom, one down. One to go. <sighs> it's not long enough, y'all. What to do, what to do. Not to worry. Just line it up as best as you can. Alright y'all, so it says five. I do have to add one more thing to make it complete. I am using my Dymo Letra Tag Labeler. And basically I just need the hundred part. If I can spell hundred, that'll be wonderful. There you go, and print. I love this thing. All right, I've gathered my thoughts. So for this one, I'm gonna try to do like a background thing like this here, just to see how it'll come out um, with the words in the middle. Let's see how that comes out. You know, you never know unless you try, right? So let's get it. So 
so if you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm trying to do like a 3D type thing, you know. I think it'll be kind of funky to do it that way. Use it as a background instead of, you know, the colorful part. We'll see how that comes out. I got this at Dollar Tree too, along with the hearts. I'm trying to find out the color scheme that I'm doing. All right, so we'll do our label. Shout out to the people who do this on a regular basis. Definitely take some patience. Don't get me wrong, it's fun, but it takes some patience. thing and then I'm done with it I'm done completely done all right that's it that's it that's it all right I'm done with this one what do y'all think yay or nay I mean it's completely different than this one so yeah Let's do two more here. All right, so the next one's gonna be more colorful because those ones were, you know, black and gold, silver. So the next one's gonna be more colorful. So I am going to start with uh, Z Butterfly. And I was hoping to find more numbers, but I couldn't, I looked everywhere. Sorry about the noise, the ambulance, if you can hear it. I hope everyone's okay out there, whoever they're going to get. All right, so we'll start with, ooh, listen, butterfly, chill out. Okay, we'll start with the butterfly. Mm. Boom. Yeah, I was hoping to find like colorful numbers, letters, something. But I couldn't find anything. I was kind of disappointed. But, oh well, it is what it is. Yeah, I was hoping to get, you know, the Dymo letterhead. I wanted it to be colorful too, but I couldn't find any on Amazon. That's where I got it. No, actually, I'm sorry. Well, that's where I got the tape, but the, the Dymo um, itself, this machine, I got it at Walmart a long time ago and never used it until now. And I'm talking like four years ago. All right. You know when you buy something and you're like, oh man, I can't wait to be creative and I can't wait, and then you put it in the closet and you're like, maybe next weekend, and then you just never get to it. Yeah, that's exactly what happened with this one. So I went ahead and took the the butterfly off because it just was not working for me, guys. It just was not working. So I just have to work with it, I guess. And we're just, you know, there's nothing planned here. Just, you know, randoms, random pieces and hope it comes out good. <laughs> Basically, that's what we're doing here. It's a little color blocking, you know, since I don't have, the main purpose of this is to have this, right? So, I mean, you, you can be creative. You can make it however you would like. So I am going to add a border. These are just too big for me. I don't know why I didn't realize how big they were until now. I could use this. Yeah, let's see how that comes out. Okay. 
Come on. There you go. Who out there likes arts and crafts? Let me know. Let me know. Better. Much better. All right. So that's one. And I'm just going to do another row at the bottom. And I'm calling it a day. All right. It's funny. I feel like right here is so empty. But should I add something else? Maybe too much. Less is more. Less is more. I'm going to keep it that way. All right, so that's number three. Okay, okay. We're going with these this time. Something colorful. For those who love color, there you go. You're welcome. <laughs> And I'm just going with the flow. I don't really have a plan, guys. I'm just going with the flow. As you should in life, right? We should be going with the flow. I'm just going to go for it, guys. I'm just going to go for it and see what happens. Is there magic in the air? And wave your hands like you just don't care. Alright guys, I'm going off track now here. Alright, that's the beginning, alright? Alright, so we're going to have to be color blocking on this one. Because I can't find any other that would go with it. And I'll make this one a thousand. So let's get this done. What I'm going to do is take these out. And then I'm gonna add. I'm gonna add the arrow. Oh. I think that's my favorite part of this. <laughs> Is being able to do that. Better. And then last but not least. Again, shout out to those who do this all the time. I feel like it's missing something up here now. Maybe a small rim, maybe? Y'all tell me if it looks retarded, right? <laughs> Would you? Don't be shy. Oh, that's the babies. You hear them? Let me hurry up. They're hungry. All right. And there you have it, guys. So yeah, that is it for now. What do y'all think? I don't know. Mm. Definitely not my favorite, but you know, it's cool with the color blocking and all that, right? All right, so yeah, these are the ones I have. Tell me which ones are the best ones. This is one. This is number two. You see the shininess? This was number three. And this was number four. 
Which one was your favorite one? I just wanted to show you that there is an alternative and you can make it yourself and make it exactly how you want it to look. All right. And to get the first shape, just so y'all know, I just took a, a bill and I just, um, I traced it and cut it. Basically, that's why I, I, I knew exactly how I wanted it. But again, if you have that cutter, it will make it so much easier. It took me longer because I didn't have that cutter. Well, that is it, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video. You know, comment down below, like this video. If you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. It is free. Thank you so much for your support. And until next time, peace.